do? I'm a snorter like a pig. Mm -hmm. I'm a snorter. Where are you going? I don't know. You know I'm filming you. You. This is a documentary <laughs> of Grandma. Oh, my goodness. The old people documentary. Exactly. Now I'm going to turn you upside down. Now you're upside down. What do, do you I have to say better? for your upside down self? Do I look better upside down? Well, I can't see you upside down when I put it on YouTube. Uh, when I watch the video, it'll turn you upside down. You right now, you're upside down. This in YouTube. No, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. No, I'm not putting this on YouTube. But gonna, okay, now I'm gonna turn you back right side up again. Okay, which is better, upside down? I can't see you when you're upside down. You have to watch the video. You have to stop it and watch oh, the video. Oh, I do not want to watch the video. Yes, you do. <laughs> no, no, no. I hate to see myself because it looks exactly like me. <laughs> You don't I like to see to how old ladyish you are? No. I like to pretend I'm about 20 years younger and about 50 pounds. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You still have yellow on your eye. When you close your eye, look. Ah, you still have yellow on it. Hmm. Still yellow. Still yellow. Yeah. Here is all your signs. Oh, is that true? Do you think a that's true? student made that for me. It's from 1970s. A documentary of grandma. Pretty boring, huh, folks? I'm just pretty boring. <laughs> so, what happens when you make a movie? You oh. record the mouth. Oh. Let me tell you the, my funniest story about the movie theater. Okay, I okay. guess my fans would like to see that. Hmm. That's probably the funniest thing that's ever happened to me. Wow. One day, <laughs> my friend and I. We're act it out. Movies. Act it out. How can I act it out? Because it's a movie. There's a movie theater over there. Oh, okay. My friend and I met at the movies, and we were late. So, the movie had already started. So, we go creep, creep, creeping in because it's very dark. And we it's in a great, great, great big theater with a whole bunch of seats. Is it bigger and than this house? Probably so. Okay. And so we pick a row, and then we creep, creep, creep down the row. And you can't wanna, see anything. We can't see Not anything. a thing. No, it's how movies start a lot of times, and they're very dark in the beginning. Mm -hmm. So we were wa walking, and we creep, creep, creep over. And then we see these people, and we sit down next to these people. Okay, so we watch the whole movie, and then we stay for credits. And the people get up and leave, but we want to see the credits. So we stay till the lights come on. So when the lights come on, we find out that they were the only people in the whole big movie theater. And we had sat next to them. But didn't you see them when you sat there? We did, but we thought there was other people in the movie theater too. Like but behind you or in front of you? In front of you, exactly. And so... We've laughed and laughed about that and thought what those people thought. Here, the whole movie theater is open, hundreds of seats, and these old ladies come and creep and sit right next to the only people there. So we have laughed and laughed and laughed about that story. Forever and ever and ever, because yeah. you cannot stop laughing. And she just laughing. passed away in April. Oh, now I know exactly who yeah, you're talking about. Yeah, Dale, and I got to tell this story at her. Funeral. Memorial service. Wow. I think it's the funniest thing that ever happened to me in my Ooh. whole life. Ooh. Well, okay. Now, I would like you to share us some funny stories about me. <laughs> oh, Jessica Violet Ray? Yes. Oh, my. Jessica Violet Ray. Well, one of the funniest ones was after we had our 50th wedding anniversary party. And Jessica was, we were eating somewhere, and Jessica says to me, can I tell you something, Grandma, and I don't it think won't we're, offend I don't you. Think we were, were sitting at this table right here. It was that table? That table right there is where it happened. But Grandpa wasn't standing right there. <laughs> no, I don't think Grandpa was around. I feel like we were out there. Nope, second, it maybe. was right up there. Okay. And you said, can I tell you something, and you won't get offended. <gasps> Offended, okay. Offended. And I said, oh, What did Jessica okay. say? And then Jessica says, Grandma, you have way too many friends. 
Wow. And what did I tell Jessica? I said, you can never, ever have too many friends. If you well, guys were at the anniversary party, you would agree with me. No. And I said, well, what makes you say that? And you said that Grandpa didn't even know all of my friends. And so that's too many friends. If Grandpa's known me for over 50 years and he doesn't even know all my friends. So that was your reasoning. Mm -hmm. But if we invited all the people you knew to a party, that would be a big party too. How about the finding party of Lily? This little cute girl. Well, Jessica's Can I tell my own story? Sure. Okay, so Emily and Jessica were over. Emily and Mama. Well, Mama now, because she adopted me. And, they, and Emily was babysitting Mommy. And they went in the secret hideout. And they found me. And I was naked. I had no clothes on. And they made, actually made a video. It was a year ago. And they thought I was creepy. Mm -hmm. And they were laughing about me. And they were like, boo! And then they were making me hang <laughs> Oh, say it, say it, say it. And then, so, Mama got me and she gave me to, to get Grandma to get rid of me. And then Grandma thought, what did you think? I thought she would look much cuter with clothes on. I don't like naked babies. So she put clothes on me. And then, when, just when Mama came over, she thought I was cute with clothes on. And so she adopted me. And it was a happy ending to the story. And I love you, baby. <laughs> I love you, baby. Baby. Yes. Baby. So now there are some stories. why you live at Grandma and Grandpa's house. I live at Grandma and Grandpa's house, a great grandma and great grandpa's house, because Grandma is so mean. I hate her. She thinks I'm the ugliest thing she's ever met, and she thinks I'm. My voice is creepy. She thinks I'm creepy and ugly, and she's even made several videos about it, and you guys probably know too. But I'm not. I'm adorable. But she thinks I'm ugly. And great grandpa and great grandma think I'm precious, precious, precious. Yeah. So I stay where I'm loved. Bye, bye. <laughs> okay, that's a long.